Hard to believe situation at a high school in New Hampshire after a lunch lady says she was fired for giving a student a free lunch worth only eight dollars. Bonnie Kimball says she was accused of theft by the food vendor mm -hmm. and also claims she asked a teen to pay his debt, which was settled the very next day. Two workers quit in protest, but the food provider says the information provided and reported is untrue, mm -hmm. although they didn't really specify. I love lunch ladies, Greg. All right, you know what? Feed I'm gonna, me. I am going to take a uh, unpopular uh, stance on this because I don't really believe the story completely. She should have gotten in trouble. And by the way, eight bucks is a lot of money. Only eight bucks is a lot of money. Look, talk to any bar owner or watch any episode of Bar Rescue. The thing that kills a business is people giving away free booze, wait, free but, drinks. Wait, wait, but Greg, easy she got for, paid back. It's easy for a bar. I'm just trying to make an argument. It's, <laughs> e it's easy for a bartender to be generous if the, he doesn't pay for the booze. So she wasn't giving away her food. She was giving away the school's food. She should be arrested and put away for this 10 years. <laughs> lock and her the, up. Lock her up. And the child needs to go away to camp, uh, a summer camp, Dana, a fun I feel camel. like you have a different point of view here. None of that. Well, I, I feel for her and and also for the boy right because it's not easy if you and if you're broke right and, and then but what i do think is interesting she uh she took that risk she allowed him to do that and then if you do that you often do get paid back yeah. right and he, she, he pay, they paid it back the next day juan i wonder if it was one of those michelle obama lunches because those aren't even worth eight dollars. <laughs> I love what, how you brought is, the Obamas into this. But I don't even know what is a Michelle Obama. I remember, it was like mystery meat or like no meat, one of those things. Everyone hated them. Oh, oh I don't know. I don't know. What? We covered it at Fox for I, like I years. Forget. <laughs> 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 well, it's a good thing I didn't go to the cafeteria, I tell you that. But I would, you know, I just felt for her, and I noticed that two of her colleagues uh, quit in support of her. But then it, apparently part of the story is that the food service had a competitor come in and was looking mm. at the school that day, and they were worried that the school district was going to give the business to the uh, competitor. I knew there was there another something else going on here. Yeah. That's a good point. What about you, Dagan? This is what we are these days. We punish good people. Tater tots forever. I don't care who's <laughs> serving. I love tater tots. All right.